Okay, man, let's check in on my sales real quick. Oh my God, down 34%. Oh. All right, guys, listen up. Amazon Wholesale is dead. That's right. You heard me say it. I will be the only one to tell you straight up to your face um, that Amazon's dead. Amazon Wholesale is dead. That's it. Give up. That's all. That's it. Okay, guys, so now that you've heard me say it, that Amazon Wholesale is dead, let's jump right into the juicy details. I'm sure you guys are all really uh, you know, curious on what exactly I'm talking about. I'm sure there's some of you out there that are selling on Amazon that are saying, what are you talking about? Like, I'm making money on wholesale right now and, and I'm selling a great course too. So listen up guys, this is what's going on, okay? The business has changed. Amazon Wholesale FBA is not what it used to be. It's not what these people are selling you on Amazon or Instagram, or sorry, uh, YouTube or Instagram. It's not the same old shit, okay? The, the business used to be like this, and this is what everybody is still teaching you and trying to sell you in these expensive, phony, baloney courses. And like I said, guys, I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate for this, but nobody will tell you the truth about Amazon Wholesale. The, nobody's gonna tell you what the business used to be like, what it's like now, and what you need to do to going forward if you wanna be successful in this business. And I'm gonna break this down into two videos for you guys. Number one, let's jump into what the business used to be like and why it's dead and why it's not what it used to be, okay? It used to be like this. You used to be able to, and this is what everybody teaches you, go on Amazon and find a product that's selling great. And guys, just, to let you know, this is what I used to teach too, because I was super successful in this business. I made seven, or I, yeah, I did over seven hundred thousand dollars in sales with this business model. So I'm not blaming anybody, but I, what I am doing is I'm saying that if anybody's still teaching this today and charging you money for this, if you're buying a course on on how to be successful in Amazon wholesale, you're wasting your money. And anybody that's selling these courses should be ashamed of themselves for taking money from you if they're gonna teach these old tactics. Um, so here we go, guys. This is what it used to be like. You used to be able to get on Amazon, find a product that was selling awesome, that Amazon wasn't selling, so that means that you're not competing directly with Amazon, and what you would do is you would go and find that brand or that distributor, the, the distributor or supplier that sells that product, and you would contact them and basically get access to that product and then you would jump on that listing and then just start selling it with everybody else and you would just milk the cow until the cow you know didn't give any more milk and so that's what the old business was now like I said, I was super successful with that business, but guys, guess what's happening now? With the power of the internet and the popularity of e-commerce and everybody realizing that all the sales are going on Amazon.com or .ca now, everybody is going on YouTube and watching these same videos and or taking the same courses that you're wasting your money on and they have the same information, guys. So they're doing the same things. And what do you think is happening when you have thousands of people contacting the same distributors? They're starting to realize a couple things. Number one is they're not selling to people like myself and you anymore. They're, they're, they're tightening, like at the bare minimum, they're tightening up their restrictions and we're not meeting their criteria. Okay. So there's hurdle number one. Okay. Number two guys is they are not selling to thousands of people okay they they are at the very least they're they're selecting a few small or a few a handful of sellers that they will sell their products to directly and they allow them to handle all of their amazon sales this is called an exclusive agreement basically whether it's one person or it's just like four or five people so that way they can control the product so if you're not already on that list Good luck because you're not getting on that list, okay? Because like I said, thousands of other people like myself and you are looking for these best-selling products, contacting the same distributors, and that's not working anymore. And number three, which is probably one of the biggest things that I'm seeing right now, guys, is that e-commerce used to be super new. 
Uh, Amazon FBA used to be new. The cat's out of the bag, guys. Everybody knows now that it's not new. They know that most sales that are online are going through Amazon. So if they if they start seeing these stats and then they start seeing that thousands of people are contacting them and saying, hey, I'm an Amazon seller. I want to sell on Amazon. What do you think they're going to start thinking or what they're going to start doing? They're, they're going to scratch their head and say, what's going on here? Let's look into this. Why is everybody doing this? Where? Why is all our sales now mostly coming from Amazon? Because all the sales are moving online. So when they look into this, guys, they see, oh my God, here's a platform that can easily facilitate all our orders and we have an opportunity to sell directly to Amazon or even better, sell directly to the consumer ourselves. And so guys, these companies are already they're starting to transition and transform and realize if we're not selling online, our business is dying. So they're now opening up websites like Shopify or their own e-commerce websites where they are, uh, you know, taking orders and shipping directly to the customer. And then when they see that all these Amazon cut, all these Amazon sellers like myself and you are contacting them, they are actually being like, okay, why don't we just sell directly Amazon FBA ourselves or directly to Amazon and sell directly to the consumer, which means more profit in their pockets. And then they cut guys like us out. So take it from me, guys. Like I said, you're not going to hear this from other people, but what's happening is that they are selling or sorry, they are contacting people like myself and I'm losing accounts uh, or suppliers, distributors, access to brands left, right and center guys. Like I cannot express this enough that literally every probably on a weekly or bi-weekly basis I'm getting a phone call hi is this such and such from this business yes it is I'm sorry to uh, to inform you you know like thank you for selling our product for the last three years but we're no longer uh, gonna be selling to you you're no longer allowed to sell our products on Amazon Boom, that's it. I just lost a major part of my business guys. One distributor could be bringing in, thousands of dollars a month for me and I can take a massive hit like that. So, you know, as much as there's a million different brands and products out there, guys, this is what happens. You go out there and find that that product or that distributor and you put in hours or days of work to find that and then finally get access to it and then order that product. And then, yeah, you're making a little bit of money now moving forward but what happens is after all that work you put in you get the rug pulled from underneath you and then you get no, you're stuck with product or you no longer have access to sell that product you can no longer reorder it and a major part of your business is now gone so you're, if you're not always out there fighting to replenish those top selling uh, hot selling products your business is always going to be taken away from you it's like you're building a castle of lego blocks and as, as fast as you're building them, they're getting taken away from you. So you're always chasing your tail and it's a never ending cycle. So guys, there's some things that you need to be doing to separate yourself from the pack. And by buying these courses from these old, you know, gurus and stuff, you're not doing yourself any good. You're doing yourself a disservice. You're wasting your time. You're wasting your money and you're wasting your energy. So stop buying these courses, give your head a shake. Um, the information is out there for free if you dig enough. I'm going to be recording another video right after this on the tactics you need to be doing and it's 100% free guys. I have nothing to sell you. Please, if you appreciate me giving you this honest and open truth, smash that like button guys and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And please leave me a comment in the comment section below. I would love to hear what your guys thoughts and feelings are on what I had to say today. Um, I know this is going to be a controversial subject and a lot of people aren't going to want to hear what I have to say. Uh, but if you're serious about this business and you want to be successful in this business, you need to hear what I have to say because uh, you're being fed and sold a bunch of bullshit. So like I said, guys, please smash that like button and uh, keep an eye out for the next video on what you guys actually need to be doing to be successful if you want to be in this wholesale business because I have uh, some good juicy tips for you guys. Until the next video, guys. Thanks. Bye.